Where he at? Is he right behind this? Oh, what are you doing there? You could not be more fucking annoying. Oh, you're getting murderized by Parvati? Okay, I guess that's uh, a noble cause. I'll allow it. Nothing personal, I swear. <laughs> you did smash him to a pulp. I watched his legs come off as well. Defaced Moon Man helmet. Okay. The moon helmets do tend to be, like, some of the most useful. I nearly got to do the uh, awesome decision at the end of the game through the use of a moon man helmet, but I just couldn't quite get there. Intimidate and lie. Go all the way up to 10 and f they get an extra 10 and 15 respectively. How do I look? Oh! Oh, so horrifying! In what way is it deface? Oh, we've scratched out his fucking... Eyes, yet again. Why is this place so obsessed with eyes? You leave my optic orbs alone, you fucks. What's this? A drain of time. And another bypass chance. Not that I ever really need it. I'm so overloaded on all the necessary shit. Ah. Oh. Okay, something I actually need to crack. And some of that leather goggles. They, uh, are really, really good. Who's the doctor of the team? Is it Ellie? If I remember correctly, she's like a surgeon for no reason. Right? That's just part of her backstory. Oh, you, I did give you the handguns thing. Interesting. I'm gonna give you this. I think you have medical skills. Yeah, you do. And you even give me some medical skills by being here. That's cool. I can give you different behavior. I think I probably already set you guys up. I'd be surprised if I didn't. So I'm not gonna fuck with that. CPR. You just do cool shit. Status effect. Name. Jurate. She does nothing. Okay, well that sucks. Screens like that make me think that this RPG was supposed to be, you know, much more of an RPG, um, like, earlier on in development, but it just never really came to fruition. I'm not sure- did I really hurt myself more than I hurt anyone else? For fuck's sake, you're running into your own traps! What is wrong with you idiots? Oh yeah, I forgot Intimidate makes them piss themselves when I, uh, do a fuckload of damage. Get the hell out of here. Oh no! No, 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 I don't want to piss myself! That's the sniper. I should probably return sniper with sniper, to be honest. You guys okay over there? That doesn't sound very healthy. Pummel him. I don't know why you need my permission to do that. Obviously, I want you to break their skulls open. Hello? How do you escape around here? That's not what I wanted. Well, no, 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 I'm healing in slow-mo. That's not what I wanted at all. Right, switch to the fucking shotgun, if you even have a chance anymore. But you really, really, really don't. Come on! What am I stuck on? Am I on this curb? The curb wasn't letting me pass. That tiny little thing, like one step high, you genuinely need to jump for. Orgasmic game design right there. Come on, Ellie! Oh, the fuck is still alive? He's just a sniper! Get the fuck out of here! Man. I'm a little bit struck by some of the uh, visuals here, though. I like that we're constantly in canyons and shit like that. It's it's unique to this area of the game, and I appreciate it. Here. Since it was That's an asteroid, I expected it to be exactly the same as the other asteroid. What happened to all these people? Or at least have a load of reused assets, but I don't really seem to remember anything like this. I like that it's clearly like a terraformed colony and everything. You don't normally get apartments that look like this, and they're quite this enclosed. We've seen slums before, but this is like beyond slum. And even the bits that are not slums look like, you know, they've got their own little unique style about them. Like, hey, look, we're on an asteroid. We really don't belong here. <coughs> belong here. There we go. Fucking allergies, man. I am a broken man. I have been a broken man since fucking May or whenever this shit set in. Ugh. Send me another one. It's the newest model. Oh my god. It's even better than that? I've actually never even heard of Concept to D before. I imagine that's like really, really high-end shit. Not even meant for gaming until quite- Oh my god, that's so expensive. Not even meant for gaming until like pretty damn recently. There we go. That's like NASA level bullshit. Light ammo, light ammo, light ammo, and some canned salt tuna. Never know when you're gonna need to turn it into gas and inhale it, I guess. Energy cells, trip stout. I don't know what any of this is really for. I'm really gonna overdose on this shit, aren't I? Couple of rings. This thing, this thing, this thing. Big cartridge, fuck yeah, okay. We're actually getting a lot of new stuff. Stuff that I'm never even gonna remember I have, and probably not even have enough things in the game to use, but at least it exists, right? Ooh. 
Elite Trooper, that's shit. This, however, is not shit at all. That's ammo and a half decent helmet, maybe? I didn't mean to pick it up, but whatever. It is fine. Lockpick max distance plus 2.5. I'll hold on to that, because that's weird and sounds like it's going to be useful in a very, very specific situation. Uh, so it's not worth getting rid of. Ah, uh, plasma launch, it's fine, I guess. Tusball Matthew Singh. I'll definitely be taking Matthew Singh. Model spaceship and a piece of shit. Let's get out of here. So is this just... Ugh. Is this just another set of apartments? I, I was enjoying this until it just became the same thing over and over and over again. Come on, game, I was praising you. Be nice to me. Ooh, that's that's pretty nice, actually. Uh, Ellie, what are you wearing? That piece of shit. Oh, no, it's actually kind of good. What what does this new one give? It buffs your defense skills. It, has, it does less armor, but it buffs defense skills. You've got to assume those defense skills are going to make up for it. And it's not like she needs leadership. So, oh, my God, you're awful. Jesus Christ. The world's angriest dinner lady. What's with the apron? I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that at all, but whatever, let's go. We were looking so professional. We actually looked like a mercenary band, well not mercenary band, but like hit squad or whatever the fuck. And now you have just completely ruined our vibe. How dare you? I mean, Pavati is in bright pink glowing neon bullshit, but still, she looks more professional than you. Oh, uh, ooh, grenade launcher. I don't use heavy weapons. I don't even know if I can use heavy weapons on account of being a little noodle arm bitch boy in this game. But it does a lot of damage. Goodbye, Revolver. <laughs> I like this thing already. Oh, yeah, I remember using these. I don't think I was a massive fan. How fast does it fire? Oh, I think it's because it uses such an enormous amount of ammo. Because that was using like 12 per shot. I love some of the little unique designs on the uh, on the weapons, though, because this actually looks a bit int improvised. It looks like old world... What is it? It's not Diesel Punk. It's the one in between Diesel Punk and... Oh, I don't know. The fucking Fallout style. It might actually be Diesel Punk, come to think of it. Um, there's so many terms for genres now. My poor old mind is just forgetting everything. Where are we going? There is a thing on the left over here. Fantastic comedy. A uh, comedy? Commentary! Let's go get the thing. I can't speak. I don't understand. I don't think I've ever been this fucking broken in my tiny little brain. I've been in here. I was literally just here. But I don't know if I've been up this side. I definitely haven't. Hello? Any kind of hint whatsoever? Almost definitely not, but I mean, I gotta search. Oh, fuck. Oh, fucking... Big boy vicar, we got something very special for you and an LMG at the same time. He is gonna be so happy with me. Still, I mean, if it's anything like that suit, I'm gonna definitely take that helmet. Are you anything like that suit? You're pretty good. You're pretty good. That's medium. I need that persuade. That oh, but it's so good. I don't like. I don't like medium armor on me anyway. What did I just give you? Defensive skills, right? No, medical, you need that. Pavadi, you do persuasion. I mean, your head could stand to take a little bit more weight, couldn't it? Yeah? I like you in your little homosexual Power Ranger gear and everything, but let's change that up just a little bit. There we go. It's not like we can see the helmets anyway. Am I over encumbered? Oh, fuck you. That happened so quickly. The hell did I pick up? All right, well, let's have a little look. Oh, no, it's weight as opposed to, um, items. I forgot about that. Okay. Well, I need to carry you. I can break shit down, I guess. I'm never, ever, ever going anywhere near the moon men because they need to stay. They help us out of really weird-ass situations. Uh, the refined Byzantine. That's just skills plus five in general, so I'll hold on to that. MSI Elite Helmet. I mean, you can fucking die. My engineering sucks. That's not good. Uh, Elite Trooper, there's a lot of this shit that I can just break, right? Yeah, there we go. I don't know why I'm carrying around so much of this. I didn't realize that is why we were so fucking heavy in general. Uh, I like that extra sneak, but it's fine. We don't really need it. Although I haven't really been in a situation where I've needed it in a while. Gotta keep all these regular clothes. This can fuck off. This can fuck off. 
Guess what? This can fuck up. I'm gonna stop now. Because I th we've got 20 more. I doubt I'm gonna be picking up armor anytime soon. I mean, normally I just put the big suit on someone so I don't have to carry it, but it only suits the vicar. It only suits the resident juggernaut Pringle man. So, guess we're just gonna have to wait a little bit. It's not like I use them anyway. Maybe, uh, what the fuck's his name? Felix. Does he use heavy armor? I genuinely don't remember, but fuck it, I'm sure. I'm sure I can find a use for it. I don't know, I like the vicar, but his little venture out with us today did not impress me. And since he was one of our least used in the main game, which is probably a reason to use him more here, to be honest, more than anything, but it's just, it doesn't really give me any reason to do so. Which is sad, because to be honest, Pavati and Ellie have probably d said about the same amount as him. But uh, I'm just used to them, and they give me cool buffs. I don't think he does, from what I remember, so he can stay at home. Hefty, <laughs> hefty grade. <laughs> is that the fucking scientific term? Fucking hefty, perfect. Mm. Boost determination and it's light. I don't know what determination is. I completely forget, but I imagine it has something to do with not fucking dying. And I definitely appreciate not being a corpse. So, uh, yeah, we'll work with that. For some reason, you don't work. For some reason, barely anything around the shithole works. Can I start up the power? Hi. Fuck. Just die. How many shotgun rounds can you take to the face? Not just shotgun rounds, actually. Shotgun rounds that literally set fire to you. Okay, the answer's three. I genuinely thought you could take way more than that, so I'm kind of pleased. <laughs> go away, go away, go away, go away. <laughs> I'm pressing all the wrong buttons again. Ugh. I'm not used to this control scheme. It's not a normal control scheme. I don't know if idiot me from a year ago set it up in this weird-ass way, or if this is just what Obsidian won. But it's fucking strange. There we go. Uh, I'm, I'm not... I'm not in slow-mo. Why do I feel like I'm in slow-mo? What did I drink? Am I encumbered again? Oh, no. Oh, shit. Why am I eating Raptid on me? Did I crash? Not in game, but did I, um... It just lowered my strength for a while, whatever the fuck I was eating. Why? Because it went down to 310, now it's back up to 330. That was really strong. Oh my god, buddy, what the fuck happened to you? Uh, maybe I picked something up and then it wore off? I, I don't know what the hell is going on. Energy cells, yes please. That used to be a man. That pile of viscous dust or cement or... I don't even really want to know. That used to be a guy. Oh, we're awful people. Awful, awful, awful fucking people. Let's uh, get out of there. Don't look at that, Pavati. I love you. You don't need to see this. Only I need to see this. Uh, what have we got up here? A dead man. What a surprise. And also a bin. A little bit more of a surprise. There we go. Unsanctioned. This all shit. Why do the marauders just wear miners gear anyway? I guess they all used to be miners? Makes sense. I mean, we know that the miners were exposed to something fucking gross and turned a lot of people insane. Makes sense they would have become marauders. Uh, big cartridge, necklace, and a piece of shit. Nice. You guys still alive? No, those aren't people. That is a man on a stick. <laughs> that is most definitely not a man. What am I talking about? In fact, I don't think we've actually come across that enemy. Could be a raptodon or whatever the hell they call Mantisaur's head on a stick. I can't even tell, and I'm surprised we haven't run into the canids yet either. A lot of shit we were warned about is just not showing up. There's a place called Llama Rock. I love it already. Holy shit, this is large as well. If there are actually people inhabiting this, I'm gonna be a happy man. People who aren't marauders, for fuck's sake. We're not allowed to live in somewhere that sounds as adorable as Llama Rock. Oh, for fuck's sake. There's, there's no point in that sniper anymore. What happened to all my good guns? What happened to all my fucking ability, to be honest? Oh, it's Charles! Oh, no! This is not what I expected. I did not want a piece of Charles. I never want anything to do with said fucking Charles. Buddy? Do you think? If we just knock that man down, he's using his fists. This cocky motherfucker. You know what? I'm riddling you. Oh, he's awful. I expected at least Charles from accounting to be a problem. Let alone all of his asshole friends, but no. 
Like, any bandit camp or group of marauders I've run into so far seemed straight up better than you. And now I get to run away. Your leader's dead. What you gonna do? I think if I chug endless drugs, my friends come back, right? Oh, you can't get out here? Oh, no, you can. You're just really slow for no fucking reason. That's so intimidating. You're more intimidating slow than fast. Oh, man, that's a woman as well. Or a man with a very, very adorable voice. Okay, I'm starting to really, really like this nade launcher. I thought I'd hate it. It's amazing. Oh, why did you stand up? I just wanted to hit that for fuck's sake. Oh, there it is! And you're still alive. Just fucking stop it. Took so long to ADS. It seems like it has to, like, finish the animation entirely of pulling out the gun. Like, for fuck's sake, it's already out. Just shoot some people. Oh, this is fucking horrible. <laughs> this is like arse clench fucking overdrive right now. I can't get shot like once and the sniper does obscene amounts of damage. I just put an acid round into your wang. You should not be alive right now. You should at least be a little bit more focused on your melting wang. Oh, I shot right next to you. Come on. Oh, that was it. That, that was my entire shot. Well, that was worthwhile, wasn't it? Here we go. Don't you dare get me killed. At least flinch. At least it's a giant fucking shotgun, man. I wonder if I can get a knockdown mod or anything like that. I don't think I've ever seen one, but it would be fucking good if I could. Inferno Scythe. It's actually awful, but obviously I'm taking something called the Inferno Scythe. I would be insane not to. Where's that taking me? And where the fuck is big old Charlie Boy? Is this Charlie Boy? This is Charlie Boy. He's got yet another defaced moon helmet. Huh, fair enough. Special delivery. What's a science weapon? What does it do? Pneumatic tubes filled with explosives to deliver death rather than envelopes. Beautiful. I fucking love it. Lock picking helmet. I'll take that. Probably over encumbered again. We're very, very close to- I broke down so many suits of armor and like a little moon man is enough to weigh me down again. Jesus Christ. I wish you could store stuff on the ship actually. That would be really cool. I don't think that's a thing. It sounds like something that very well could be a thing and I just never used it or forgot about it. Um, but I, I'm pretty damn sure it's not a thing. Any reason to be here? Other than murdering Charlie Boy? Who even asked me to do- I don't think I was ever told- I was ever asked to do this. I was just told about him. But this doesn't seem to leave me any closer to actually, you know, doing a mission. You know what a mission is, game? Because I, I would really like to learn right about now, for fuck's sake. Just wandering around ending people for not a whole lot of gain. Another helmet that I already had. Oh god, what did you do to these guys? These guys are on your team, you idiot. Fair enough. Just do them, making my job easier. I better not question Great it. Work. Thanks! Uh, what do we got here? Revamped power helmet. That does nothing. Ooh, wait. No, it's shit. Never mind. Armor parts. Weapon parts. Bits. Plasma cut- I guess the cutter's pretty half decent, maybe a bit, yes. Yeah, I'll take it. What do we got over here? Not really anything, I can't get in there anyway. It's gotta be a building, or a base of operations, or, I don't know, some half decent fucking loot, or <laughs> a lead, or anything, come on! I mean, uh, he did tell us he got in trouble with- oh, fuck, I thought that was a person. Did tell me she got, he got in trouble with marauders, right? And it's probably just a little bit likely that they're the ones who chewed his arms off. So... Game? Y you want to do something with that information? No? Okay, fair enough. Oh well, at least Charlie Boy's dead. I guess that's our good deed for the day. We committed many murders. Ooh, okay, never mind. Sorry, game, I, I judged too soon. This is a massive ass area and it's probably- Oh, those are canids. Those are canids unlike any I've ever fucking seen. Jesus. Sparklers. I'm ready for this. Will it die in one? It will not die in one, but it won't be nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be. There you go. Oh my god, where did you even go? Yeah, that was a really poor choice. This had to land right fucking next to me, didn't you? Idiot. I don't like that sound. But also I think he's- Oh, he broke my leg. I forgot that was even a thing. I thought you could get crippled in this game. I like that you can get crippled in this game. That's actually really fucking cool. 
And it reminds me of old school Fallout, which is always a good thing. Can I actually land a shot, please? Thank you. Oh, you were doing so well, I just cucked you right at the end. Oh, you deserve better than me, Pavani. Way better than me. Apparently, that's not hitting, even though that's directly on his goddamn chest. Just fucking die, little arsehole. Oh. Oh, that's what they're, they're like, making a noise to summon more or something? Or are they just bugging out and screaming? Just to be honest, same. Uh, what do we got here? An empty ass bin. Fucking empty void of nothingness. What's this? Post apocalyptic. I'm sorry, I probably did not read that nearly in time, dude. <laughs> I don't know what you're referring to. But yes, I assume you are right, for you are right about all, Papa Scott. Uh, burst pockets, energy cell, adrena time, adrena time, adrena time. And nothing fucking useful. I don't know why I'm even bothering picking this up. I know I'm not going to use it. I guess I could sell it to these poor bastards and just become a drug... I don't even need money, though. <laughs> like, <laughs> I might as well stop hoarding that as well. Just give it out to these poor fucks who clearly, clearly need it. Pancake mix. Thank you very much. Pre-sliced bread. Thank you very much. Ketchup, whatever the fuck that is. Energy cell. Deadeye assault rifle too. What's mine? Mine is the exact same, except acidy. Yeah, not a whole lot of difference. Oh well. Oh well, let's read this thing. Thank you for the cash. Diane. Sh oh god. Shooter. Sh shooter? Shooter. Or just shoot. Whatever. Final report. To the co worker who finds this. You're a woman, but apparently you sound like this. So that's fine. Given you're reading this, I'm likely dead. I'm very sorry about that. I'm also sorry Space's Choice had to send someone else to finish my assignment. As of the moment I'm writing this, Charles Novak still possesses the express mail delivery prototype, and I believe he's gone entirely mad. As he has abandoned his apartment and taken up with a group of marauders not far from here, Charles no longer recognizes me. He can't even recognize the Space's Choice jingle. Oh God, no, the humanity. When I sing it for him to try to co coax him into a calmer state, he shot me in the arm. If you're here to retrieve the prototype, here is what you should know. The prototype remains intact. The prototype has been modified to simultaneously fire multiple projectiles, and the original package housing chamber appears to have been replaced with an explosive payload. Please know that I did not sanction these modifications, nor do I approve of setting fire to company correspondence. Charles's depravity knows no bounds. Maybe the people he killed is uh, something to focus on just a little bit more, lady. The original prototype was intended to deliver packages more quickly, nothing more, and I'd sooner die than see it used for violence. To that end, I'm gonna try and recover the prototype from Charles. Should I fail? Please remember me fondly, despite my incompetence. Faithfully, Diane Shoot. I mean, I didn't find her corpse, but there is absolutely no way she succeeded unless, ooh, whoa, unless she ended Charles and took up the Moon Man disguise, took up his, uh, legacy. I can't speak English. That's not what I tried to say, but we're going with it. Ah. Get more adrenaline. How much do I have now? How much of a horrible, horrible person have I become? 166. We now have more Adrena time than we ever even had Adreno that I've been collecting for the entirety of the main game. They have been throwing so much at us. I've spammed E like 400 times. A lot more than 400 times in just this session, but still. Ah, uh, Adrena, Adrena, Adrena. Aged Iceberg and some actual Adreno. Much better. Thank you. What do we got around here? Light ammo. And a bin. What more could a man possibly want? Just wonder if we can find that woman. I mean, I don't think... It's just, like, he shot her in the arm. It's clear she, he recognizes her in the fucking slightest, at the very least. Clearly, not a whole lot. What's that? Wipe your feet. Don't we know a, a foot wiper? Who was that fucking foot wiper? Ah, yeah. I think this might be Von Rothman or whatever the fuck his name was. I think this might be his house. And it's as ugly as I expected. Good job, buddy. Archibald Excelsior, Ace Exterminator, and the Plague of the Manti Men. That's, that might just be the most uh, homoerotic thing I've ever seen. Um, I'll be right back. I, th I think I just need to go think about something uh, in the bathroom. Uh, no, never mind. That can wait. What do we got here? Another phonograph. Yay. Well, Dr. Ambrose, tell me about Adrena time. 
Oh, I got part two before I got part one. Fuck's Hasn't sake. Clarence already dumped a pile of promotional materials on your head? Where's the fun in that? My listeners want to hear it in your own words. <sighs> it's an injectable drug that improves a patient's speed, awareness, mental acuity, and endurance. I could really use that in right now. I'm broken. The time will uplift the laboring classes by strengthening their minds and work ethic. That's quite the mission. Just like that toothpaste that makes everyone anorexic? That was a great idea, too. I am a solutions-oriented woman. I see a problem, and I am moved to solve it. Poverty is one such problem. Through science, I believe we can improve the poor. And in so doing, improve Halcyon. I mean, I guess at the very least she sorta cares? It's clearly just because efficiency, and I guess a not absolutely emaciated half-dead set of poor people uh, I mean, emaciated half-dead people don't make amazing employees, I have to say. Trust me, I've got many. Um, but yeah, I mean, I guess she tried to do some good in her own weird little fucking way. I mean, it's not like we're against her anyway, we're actually trying to help her. Or at least help her, um, very, very, very distant daughter. I don't believe she's dead, though. I think we're gonna find her. I think we're gonna find a lot of these people that we're supposed to be, be uh, we're supposed to believe are just fucking dead. Am I over-encumbered yet? Yes, very. Which is why I can't fucking sprint. Oh, no! It's gonna take forever. I think I'm gonna try and just break shit down for now. And then, um, get rid of shit properly off camera. Because it will just take forever. What is that ugly little fucking thing? Boost tech skills. I guess I kinda need it. Don't know why you're still here. Uh, that's not very good. Also, mm, that's kinda good, I guess. No, it's not that great. Keeping that just for its weird ass special ability? Handguns? No one really uses handguns. Who the fuck likes handguns? I mean, Ellie, but I took that away from her. She's not allowed anymore. Yeah, that'll do. Didn't need to do a whole lot. What's this? Another champion toss ball. We're gonna toss all the fucking balls and then go through here. Nothing is happening. I'm <laughs> just fucking wandering around, occasionally getting a goddamn audio log. I like this DLC. I'm glad I'm playing more Outer Worlds, but I, I genuinely think I broke it. I, I really do. And there's just that thing in the back of my mind the whole time. For one, the tree come is making it really hard for me to think anyway. Especially think of solutions of how to unfuck the game. But, um... Yeah, I'm const- there's always in the back of my mind, I'm just like, I'm gonna have to replay all of this. <laughs> I'm gonna have to fucking replay all of it as soon as I'm done tonight, because I fucked the game. But, it's gotta be a way around it, surely. If you can kill everyone in the game, and still have the quests work, then... I must be- oh, I'm not here again, am I? How did I ignore that place last time? You sealed? It's sealed. There's gotta be a way in. Oh, it's a complete- no, this is a different place. We never made it to creative incubation. We went somewhere like this, but it wasn't this. There's gotta be another way in. Can I climb this fucking mountain? I can absolutely climb this mountain, but that's an invisible wall! Yay! Who doesn't fucking love those? So the only way in is through the front fucking door. That just doesn't work. Guess I gotta wait for someone to leave. Oh my god, I've... As if I hadn't broken the game enough already. But yeah, I don't know. And then part of me wants to stop so I have less to replay. But I'm also just like, no, that there's, it's gotta work. That there's no way that the game would uh, be this unhealthy on launch. But then again, you don't even know what version has been released on Epic. And since they're fucking up so much. The amount of times they've released an inferior version by accident. Uh, because, I don't, what was it? Like, they, they, there's so many examples of Epic just doing weird shit that they didn't need to do, and when they're trying- they're already suffering enough from a reputation of being epic. Um, they, <laughs> there's so many easy ways to avoid being completely stupid, and they just seem to take every possible opportunity to look like assholes, Or at least idiots, there we go. And I've got a lot of ammo. I don't know where this leads, but it's somewhere new. And at this point, that's kind of all I care about. I really like the whole dome idea as well. It makes the skybox look a little stagnant and gross, but then I like that that's what people are looking up and seeing anyway. It sort of adds to that, uh, 
this place fucking sucks kind of vibe. I didn't think we're welcome here, Captain. Is it weird that all these traps just make me want to see what they're hiding? Oh, there are people here? Well, that's a fucking horrible sign. I was making as much noise as a human can possibly fucking make. Well, that's the phonograph. This was easy. There's so many of these things. Goddamn. Two in one place. And a fucking bowler hat. Oh, I am, I am, I am. Oh, yes. It's inspiration. I don't even know what that does. But look at me. This is the way we were meant to be. For our entire lives, the hair looks fucking vomit worthy. But oh my god, I don't know if I can resist. That might be the best thing I've ever seen. I think this is now the character I'm most proud of ever creating. And I made Pigman. I made Cockhoover. But this guy, whose name I don't even remember. Look at him. A true, delicious masterpiece. I can't look at it any longer. I'm sorry. Go away. Oh my god. <laughs> that was really, really horrible. I just couldn't make my guy look decent. That There was just no way for him to not look like he's on every register imaginable. So uh, that's about the best we're going to get. Light ammo, light ammo, light ammo, and this we thing. Call them marauders. Like they have some kind Why can of I only take those three? There's like 500 here. The name was coined in Edgewater, I think. One of the towns first hit by the Adrena time crisis. A lonely spacer's choice outpost on the edge of a barren sea. A prime place for the company to test a disastrous new product. When the town started fraying at the edges, hardly anyone else in the colony noticed. Just like Lucian planned. I read the reports. Every missing person. Every unexpected death. A town already teetering on the edge, and Adrena time shoved it off a cliff. Huh. So she does care about those lowly plebeians. Fair enough. You're not as awful as I expected. Let's go. Become marauder. People talk about them as if they've transformed, like they've mutated. I see it in the Aether Wave broadcasts, read it in the papers. But beneath their masks, the only people. Dangerous people with a terrible illness, but people still. When we call a man a marauder, have we given up on him? Yeah. How do we know when We know they still have him? some form of thoughts, How like... How can you decide to give up on someone? Have I... Leonora's I husband was still trying. Who does this suffering serve, I wonder? Spacer's choice? So I just really like that the only visible thing here is FLAKES and nothing else. In all caps.